Persephone? I was looking for Akati. I can't imagine what you need her for, but never mind. Do you know what the hardest part is about my life here? I don't. It's not knowing who to trust. Akati has been my dearest friend ever since my mother, the meteor, sent her to me. But after that nonsense with Lethe's water, I've been keeping a closer eye on her. Ekati always tells me where she's going, but not this time. My spies tell me she's about to resurface for a secret meeting at Iphigenia's compound. Sounds like the meeting's not so secret anymore. That's where you come in. Spy on her and report back to me. I'm trusting you with this. Please, don't let me down. Looks like this is my chance to find out what the cut is up to, too. There she is.
I was wondering when you would arrive, locksmith. You know I prefer Keymaker. Your mastery of language is overwhelming as always. How you stay so humble is beyond me. You know why I'm here, Ricardi. We need to talk about your newfound friend, the Keeper. Don't worry. I didn't tell Alexios about the key to the underworld you cleverly disguised as Ross's collar. Why would I want him running straight to Persephone's palace? It's not about that. I know you've been spending a lot of time together, and undermining Persephone in the process. Alexios has been undermining Persephone, not me. At least, that's what Persephone will see when I'm through. I'm all too familiar with your ability to whisper in Persephone's ear, but whatever tale you spin for her isn't the truth, is it? You've been trying to push Persephone out of power! Hermes, you know her quest for control is corrupting her. You must see that Persephone has changed. The only one who wants control is you. Why can't you support her? <laughs> it's true. You are jealous of her. Doing everything Persephone tells you isn't helping her, Ernest. Let alone getting you what you so desperately desire. Could either of us really help her after what she's gone through? But I am no traitor. You know I love Persephone like a sister, Ernest. If I could free her from Elysium, I would. But freeing her from corruption is the best I can do. Hey! You're not supposed to be here! Keep her! Ernest, we have to go! Here we go! His collar is the key to opening the gate to the underworld. <laughs> now to find a way to get it. So you were the one I couldn't trust. Ekati has told me all about your treachery, including your breaking into my sanctuary. I couldn't have gotten in if Ekati hadn't given me the key. But you did break in? Yes, to steal a journal about the gate to the underworld. You are the only one with the key. Alexios stole it from me, just like he stole the last of Lethe's water from the cave. But Alexios destroyed it. Don't play games with me, Ekati. I know who was behind Lithi's water circulating in Elysium. The point is, there's been trouble in Elysium ever since you got here. That's no coincidence. You're clearly trying to push Persephone out of power. I may be working against Persephone, but you've been helping me the entire time. There! Out of your own mouth! You're trying to overthrow me! You can't believe these lies! A silver tongue joined the delinquents operating in Defcalion's heritage after this outsider helped her. The timing is curious. Furthermore, a gathering of your most devoted followers was recently targeted. Yes, 
No one was hurt, but Aconite was found in the wine. Your signature death sentence, if I recall correctly. Curiously, the last of my batch was stolen from me right before the party. It wasn't me. Is it a coincidence then, outsider, that someone matching your description was seen fleeing the Follower's Symposium? Enough! I have reason to suspect the both of you of treason at this point. Egati is my oldest friend in the Underworld, and for a while I thought my truest. Give me one reason why I should believe your word over hers. This is all part of her plan. But your instincts were right, Persephone. Hecate is the traitor. You can't possibly take the words of an outsider over mine. Persephone. Hecate is right. I'd have to be out of my mind to take your word over hers. Nothing's been paradise since you dropped in. You are no longer welcome in my palace. We've received word those delinquents in Defkeluon's heritage are on the move. Not now. This is urgent, my queen. Fine. I'll handle this later. I should have known you would stab me in the back. You can't betray someone you never held any loyalty for. Adonis's troops should be strong enough to take Persephone down. I should let him know. I've had scouts looking everywhere for you. I didn't think to check Persephone's throne room. You should be thanking me. Persephone knows what we're doing. She's prepared. That's so? Then we need to strike and we need to do it now. Hmm. For Aphrodite. And for your freedom to breach the gate out of this realm. Before we fight, I have something for you. What's this? One of Hermes' keys to eternal flame. If your craftspeople can make it, you'll be able to ignite fires that never go out. But Adonis, only use it if you absolutely must. I swear.
Don't get in my way! It was you this whole time? You let me worry about these delinquents? All my worry, all this suffering, was because of you! I told you, I'm getting to that gate, whether Persephone likes it or not! Now get out of my way! I will not! It doesn't have to be like this, Hermes. It could have been different between us. You were my friend, but you've given me no option. I have to protect the one I love. So, this is what friendship means to you? Pointed in you. You failed me for the last time, Hermes Trismegistus. It. 
Persephone's control over Elysium needs to end. Now! You! Don't move a muscle! Don't let him get away with anything. We're in this together. I'll always be at your service. Even outside of Elysium? If it comes to that? I'll be there. For now, I'll leave you too. I'm sure there's plenty to talk about. You're making a huge mistake. With war brewing outside my window, I wonder what you'd suggest I do instead. Your beautiful Elysium has turned to rubble. All because of your stubbornness, Persephone. You fool! I made this place beautiful for you! Nothing I've ever done for your love has been good enough! You're a prisoner too. You should know it's impossible to love your captor. This is the last time I'll ask. Let us go. Let me go. You've turned this whole realm against me. But you didn't do it alone. Go. Your friend here won't be as lucky. Thank you, Persephone. I'm forever grateful. Go easy on Alexios. Your turn. We don't have to do this. Just let me pass through Elysium. Adonis would have rallied the people, with or without my help. You're lying! Persephone, you don't have to control everything. You're free to let go. Maybe you can finally go home. You know nothing of what I've been through. I was stolen from your world. I had no choice but to take this one for myself. Tell your boss I'm ready. Also, Bird could come get me himself. If he's not a coward. What the hell is wrong with you? What else could I do? They were out to kill us. Even Alethea ran for the hills. There was no reason to massacre them. Everything okay down there? It sounded like a war zone. We're fine, Alana. But don't expect much action anytime soon. Seems like this specific memory in the Animus is down for the count. Let me guess. That happened when you ripped me out. Great. That's the last thing we need. I had no choice. 
Complaining won't repair the computer. The memory files are overriding each other, and I'll need time to sort them out. You know what? I need some time alone. May as well head back to Greece until Alethea returns anyway. <laughs> 